Now on Night Beat, the giant CEO not facing criminal charges after a public altercation with his wife. But some people think he shouldn't get off scot free. Good evening to you. I'm Veronica Dela Cruz. And I'm Ken Bassi. Tonight, Beach Joe Vasquez is live in San Francisco, where some women are saying that Larry Bear should still be held accountable. Explain that, Joe. Yeah, Ken, what prosecutors have decided that what happened is not a crime, but that doesn't mean that the owner of the Giants is completely out of trouble. The cell phone video shows Giants owner and CEO Larry Bear aggressively wrestling his cell phone away from his wife, pulling her out of her chair and onto the ground as she screams for help. But District Attorney George Gascon said today it did not rise to the level of a crime. Quote, after a careful review of the relevant evidence, including multiple videos, statements from several witnesses, and the parties themselves, the evidence does not support filing criminal charges. We reached out to Bear through his attorney today. So far, no comment from him or the Giants. The team says they want to wait for the findings of the Major League Baseball investigation. A lot of people may want to say, well, that's not really domestic violence, or that is domestic violence. I think one thing we can be sure, it's not really the way you want to treat somebody close to you. Domestic violence victims advocate Kathy Black says she respects the DA's decision, but still believes the league should sanction and even fine Bear because the incident violates the league's policies on physical altercations. The public Public perception is he's a rich owner. He might get away with whatever, right? And I and I think there's a danger to that. Well, it's not okay. Andrea Shorter, with a newly formed group called Do What's Right MLB, agrees. She also wants Bear to face some sort of punishment. It is about what sort of message, what sort of consequences, what will the MLB do? And we are asking, challenging, and supporting that they do what's right. Larry Bear has taken a leave of absence. He has apologized. As for Major League Baseball, they have not said what they're going to do. But, Ken, there is precedence for disciplining players anyway uh, for domestic violence that wasn't charged by the criminal justice system. Uh, recently, a shortstop for sh the Chicago Cubs was uh, sanctioned 40 games. So, yes, there is a precedence for it. It's just not clear you know, whether they would do that to owners at this point. Interesting story, interesting case. We'll see how it works out. Joe, thank you for that.